Stitch style, stitch and style. Time for another sewing project. A scrunchie. Spread the fabric sheet upside down on the table. Find the scrunchie outline. And cut. Place the fabric piece upside down. Fold it along the lines to make a hem. The clips will hold the fabric in place. Start with the first side. Align the stitch line on the fabric to the stitch guide on the machine. Press to pop up the seam guide. It'll help to keep the stitching straight. Hit play and you're ready to begin. Stitch and Style has sensors that detect fabric and sew automatically. Don't push or pull fabric while sewing. It stops by itself when it reaches half a centimeter or quarter inch before the fabric end. Now pull the cutting tab back until it locks into place and cut the thread. Don't cut it at the needle or the stitches will unravel. Raise the foot lifter to release the fabric. Push the cutting tab back in place. Now fold the fabric in half so the pattern is on the inside. Use the clips. The blue or gray stitch line means stitch on the back side of the fabric. Stitch along the long side. Pull the cutting tab back. Cut the thread. And push it back into place. Now, flip it inside out. Use a pencil to make it easier. Now that's cool! Pass the round elastic string through the scrunchie. and tie the ends in a knot. Make sure it's tight. Tuck the unfinished end of the scrunchie into the finished one. Pause the machine, raise the foot lifter, and place the scrunchie ends in. And sew them together. Pause the machine, now pull the cutting tab back until it locks into place and cut the thread. Raise the foot lifter to release the fabric. Congratulations on making your own scrunchie! Your kit has everything you need to make six items. A sunglass case, purse, scrunchie, plushie, clutch wallet, and bandana. More projects on coolmaker.com.